What's good, Facebook? It's always good to see you. I know many of you have not heard this music in a minute. So I just wanted to come back and play this for you guys because this is funky jazz. That's what I said, funky jazz. So I told everybody that I was coming up for a quick few minutes to talk about the 411 on gratitude. And I've got to let you guys know about this individual that just is just so phenomenal. She's been through a lot in the past few months with COVID and all that, but somehow she manages to just be so super awesome. So with all of that said, I'm getting ready to share some stuff with you guys about a friend of mine that um, has really been there for so many people throughout the COVID. And I'm going to switch it up a little bit and I'm going to put my headset on so I can hear you a little bit better and you can hear me a little bit better, really, so I can hear you a little bit better. But uh, today I want to say hi to everybody out there. Thank you for all your support. Uh, week in and week out this morning, we did an excellent show on news you could use on one of my other channels. Thank you, Lynn Herod Diverges. Uh, and everybody that was part of that. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. But this uh, special moment right here is for a couple of folks that have really been touching my life in miraculous ways. So first things first, I want to share with you a young lady that uh, participated in one of my training classes. Her name is Brenda Robles, Brenda Robles. And uh, I don't know if I tagged you in it, but if some of y'all know Brenda, Go ahead and hit her up. I'm going to just share this with you for a quick moment. Brenda attended one of my training courses, and she was so wonderful. And she said, Lotus, I, I want to send you something. Could you send me your address? And so I said, okay. So I sent her my address, and Brenda made these earrings for me. Um, and I really love them. She made them with her own two hands. But not only did she make these earrings for me, she also made this set of earrings for me. They're still in the pack. I know y'all probably saying, Lotus, we can't see them things. Take them out the pack. So I'm going to take them out the pack. So this is another set of earrings that she made for me. And you guys know I'm a pretty colorful person most of the time. So she made those for me. And she made these for me. Okay, y'all see those? And she also made these for me. She just spoiled me, you guys. She spoiled me. And she made these for me. And, and she also made these items. Somebody hitting me up right now. Um, asking me which Zoom we meeting in. <laughs> We meeting in my Zoom, and she made these hair bows for me. So I want to thank you uh, just with so much energy energy and, and heartfelt love, uh, Rinda Robles. You made these from your own hands. And so I'm going to take this these earrings off. I bought these many years ago in a store. I love them. But when I saw these in the mail... Uh, they came and it took a long time to come folks because the, the mail is just, I mean, it's not what it used to be. So I'm going to put these in and I'm going to wear these babies because they're beautiful and they came with a heart full of love. So ladies, if you are looking for some earrings that will be made from a heart full of love, all handcrafted. Go ahead and hit her up. I'm going to show you her information right here. If you could see that, that's her information right there. Make sure you hit her up. She'll make you a pair of uh, earrings and she will send them directly to you. So make sure you hit her up and I'll try to put the information um on here as well 
so you can know how to hit her up. So special shout out to Brenda. Um, and I'm not going to tell you, we had this kind of love thing between us uh, because one time she hit me up and, and it was her husband's name. And I was like, cool is that? I don't know nobody by that name. But then she was like, oh, that's my husband's name. So I was like, oh, okay, cool. So special shout out to my girl, Brenda F. Robles. Thank you so much for the wonderful earrings. I love them and I'm wearing them and I'm going to wear them. You guys will see me come on my regular broadcast um, wearing some of her, some of her earrings. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate the hair bows. And let me tell you, she knows I, I kind of share with her and she thinks she's slick, but pink is my color. So you can see everything she made me has a hint of pink, has a hint of pink in it. So thank you so much for just the, the little, um, paying attention to things that I really like and I love. So thank you so much, Brenda. You are appreciated. And I want to thank you uh, so much for that. And also, I have another moment of gratitude I want to send out to Miss Tina Thompson. She came on. She uh, rocked the house on one of my shows. And she sent me this book. She didn't even tell me. I don't think that she was sending me the book. The name of the book is called Good Souls, Bad Souls, and Badasses. I don't know why y'all be wanting me to curse on, you know, but anyway, I guess badasses, if y'all think badasses is a bad word or maybe not so word, good, good word, um, keep it to yourself. <laughs> but if you want this book, Good Souls, Bad Souls, and Badasses by Tina Thompson, go ahead and um, go to Amazon and you can get this book. I'm getting ready to read this book. I'll let you know when I'm going to do the book reading. So those of you that want to do the book reading with me for this particular book, good souls, bad souls, and bad asses, let me know because next month I'll be starting to do my book club where we'll, we will be reading different books. And of course, you know, I've got several books, um, that I'm going to be reading. So you want to be in on this book club reading with me. I'm just saying, uh, because the more, you know, the more you grow. And I'm going to tell you, knowledge is not power. If it's not knowledge in action. Hey there, my beautiful friend, Selena Pinashimo. Good to see you. Words of empowerment. Very nice. Thank you. Hey, Dante. Good to see you as well. So like I said, I'm only going to be on here real quickly because I just wanted to send a word of gratitude out um, to the masses. And I want to send a special word to my friend, uh, precious killer pitch Williams. Um, I'm happy that you are feeling really well and all is going your way. Congratulations on the new person that you have gotten, um, to, to be on the shark tank, because I'm telling you, if you don't know precious killer pitch Williams, you need to get to know her. If you're trying to get to shark tank, if you're an entrepreneur and you, you got something you want to pitch to shark tank, she can show you how to expand your pitch, um, and get on shark tank. And don't forget. Yes. We said about a month ago, we are building something for all of you folks that want to, um, have, a pitch that's on fire. If you want to ignite your pitch and expand your niche, make sure you hit me up. Those of you that's already hit me up about the um, private uh, webinar that we are going to be having. I have not forgotten you. Precious and I are getting together. We have already got some things uh, set up in place for you. We will let you know next week when the webinar is going to take place. It's going to be fire. If you're struggling in your business, if you don't know which way is up, Precious and I are going to help you with that no bull allow. So if you want to ignite your pitch and expand your niche, we are going to help you with that. So don't forget to pass it on. So now I must share with you all one of the reasons that I came here. A good friend of mine called me a little while ago when she was like, hey, um, how you doing, Lois? What's going on? Blah, 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 blah. Now, I know that she and her um, husband have been sick with COVID. But even though she was ill with COVID, she always sent me something almost every day. She would call me just about every day before um, she had de to deal with COVID. And let me just say this. I love you. I love you. I love you. 
from the bottom of my heart to the top of my heart, expanding throughout the universe. I love you. And many of you may be asking, okay, Lotus, who is this person? So this is a special shout out gratitude to you. This is not a part of no show or nothing like that. This is just personal, honey, where I'm shouting out um, this lovely person in my life. And yes, she is a songstress. She is like always trying to make sure she's at the top of her game, but she's always looking out for people. So I want to send a special note of gratitude to my friend um, that I have come to know over a short period of time. She's an amazing lady. Um, she's a great friend. If you ever have the pleasure of uh, becoming a friend of hers, please value her friendship because she is remarkable. And for those of you that don't know, Tracy R. Kincaid, that's what I said, Tracy R. Kincaid, my friend, I want to share this brief uh, video that we put together a week ago for Tracy. And she happened to call me today and she called me to bless me uh, as she always does in word, song, or however she blesses me. I can get that lady to sing like this. I was like, Tracy, sing for me. And she'll sing for me. And it really left my spirit. You know, you always have to have a go-to person, right? So a lot of times there are certain people that I can go to or that I can just call and I don't have to talk to them every day and, and say, hey, let me run something past you. So Jeff Markinette Jr., Jeff Markinette Jr. called me this weekend and he said, hey, I haven't talked to you in a while. I'm calling to check on you. How you doing? How's your family? How's everything? How's the business? What are you doing? So thanks, Jeff Markinette Jr. That's one person. Terrence Leffridge, Mr. Unstoppable himself, Janelle Harris, uh, Sean Saxton, Wanda D, the motivational queen, um, Dr. Sandra Brooks, Lynn Harry Divergence. Uh, oh, I cannot forget, I cannot forget Marishka Norton. I cannot forget um, Ida Rezin Pessi and so many more of you, but especially to my sister Daisy, the flower of my life, um, Joyce Jones, and of course, Mary, my mother and so many other people. And of course, Angela Elton, my right and left arm. I appreciate you and love you. So to all of you, and even those that I did not mention, you know who you are on Lena, Kevin Thornton, and so many more that I have not said, I want to share this song with you because my team made this for my special friend. And today, this is my moment of gratitude. And I'm sending this out to all of you. Tonell, what's going on? Tonell Jackson, thank you so much. I love Tracy too. She's an amazing lady. So check this out. I know that Tracy is driving in her car right now. She's on her way home, Tonell. So I'm going to start this. I want you to share this with her. So share this to her page. Share this to her phone. Whatever you got to do to now. I'm, I'm depending on you. I'm depending on you. Make sure she see this on her way home. She's probably going to be crying. But hopefully she won't be crying too much because she's driving. Okay. All right. So Tracy, this is for you. I love you. I appreciate you. This is my moment of gratitude that I'm sharing with the world. But this is for you and everybody that we love. Keep on keeping on. Here we go. This is for Tracy. Okay, and I hope you guys can see this and hear this. So let me make sure you can see this and hear this. All right, there we go. All right, so it's up on the screen, folks. Um, everybody just do a virtual shout out for me, a virtual shout out and say, Hey, Tracy. Hey, Tracy. Because she's come through COVID. She's come through loss. She's come through so much. So this is for you, darling. He knows just what your future holds. Even if you can't see it. He created you wonderfully And no matter what you're feeling No matter what they say He created you to be what you're becoming today So don't give up on your goal God will complete what he started in you Cause you were destined to win And there is no failure in God 
Lord, I take you at your word. Even if I can't trace you, you have never left my side. And in every situation, through heartache and pain, we know we have the victory, and it is our super claim. So don't give up on your goal. God will complete what He started in you. Because you are destined to win, and there is no failure in God. So don't give up, don't give in, we have to know that in the end we're going to win, cause God's got us, God's got us, we have to know that in the end we're going to win. No matter what you're feeling, no matter what they say, He created you to be. What you becoming today? So don't give up on your goal. God will complete what He started in you. Cause you were destined to win, and there is no failure in God. So don't give up, don't give in. You have to know that in the end you're gonna win. Cause God's got us. Thank you, Tracy, for always being super duper awesome to everyone. So I want to ask you this question, folks. Who are you grateful for today? Have you told them that you're grateful for them? Have you told them that you love them? Have you told them how much they mean to you? Well, all of you that are out there, I really appreciate each and every one of you. Week in, week out, day in, day out that make the concerted effort to come on to the broadcast and to share it all around the world. I appreciate you. So Tracy, my friend, I appreciate you. I love you. And I want you to know that you are such an inspiration to the world. Unequivocally, you are an inspiration. You are inspiration. So keep doing what you're doing and know that we love you. Have a great day. Take care, everybody. See you next time.